Hello, uh, today I'm going to show you how to determine whether the following series is divergent or convergent. And the series is sigma ln n divided by n plus 1 when n changes from 1 to infinity. Okay? If you calculate the limit of ln n n plus 1 when n goes to infinity, that will be equal to ln 1 equal to 0. Okay, if you don't know how to calculate this limit, you can leave me a comment in the comment section and I will show you how to do that. In any case, since this limit is equal to zero, then you cannot conclude uh, the series is divergent or convergent. Note that if it were not equal to zero or if this limit did not exist, you could say this series is divergent. But now since this is equal to zero, that test is not useful. So you need to find a different way, okay? So let's compute the, uh, the partial uh, sums of this uh, series. So that is Sn equal to sigma ln i divided by i plus 1 when i changes from 1 to n. Okay? From algebra, we know that ln a divided by b will be equal to ln a minus ln b. Okay? So if you, uh, if you apply this rule into this one, that will be equal to sigma i from 1 to n times ln, uh, the ln i divided by i plus 1 will be equal to ln i minus ln i plus 1. Okay? So now, if you expand this series, so if i is equal to, so this will be basically equal to, if i is equal to 1, that will be ln 1 minus ln 2. And when i is equal to 2, that will be ln 2 minus 2 plus 1, 3, ln 3. Or when i is equal to 3, that will be ln 3 minus ln 4. And that can continue until i is equal to n, and that will be ln n minus ln n plus 1. Okay? When you look at this series, this summation, you see all the term will cancel out. Uh, except the first term and last term. So that will be equal to ln1 minus ln n plus 1, okay? Which will be equal to ln1 divided by n plus 1, okay? Using this rule, that is ln a minus ln b is equal to ln a divided by b. So here a is 1, b is n plus 1. Therefore, this, uh, so th th that means Sn is equal, which is equal to Sn. That means Sn is equal to ln1 divided by n plus 1. So therefore, sigma ln n divided by n plus 1, n from 1 to infinity, this sigma will be equal to limit Sn when n goes to infinity. In other words, that is equal to limit ln 1 divided by n plus 1 when n goes to infinity. And 1 divided by infinity is equal to 0, and therefore this will be ln 0. But we know that doesn't exist. Okay? That doesn't exist. That means this limit doesn't exist. And therefore, uh, you can conclude that this series is divergent because this limit does not exist. Okay? Divergent. I hope you found this video helpful. If you are interested, please feel free to subscribe into this channel so that you get updated when I upload new videos. Thank you.